No. Who has this sheet of paper? Anybody? <laughs> I just, just gotta find this one person. Why should it be like I just had to just go to the guy with the with the ripped piece of paper and he'd be like, there. <laughs> Did you try? At least try. I don't know where he is anymore. I don't know where I am on the map. Where am I? <laughs> A map of the southernmost part. Where am I on this map? I'm all the way up there? Fuck. Oh look, this guy's macking on this girl. <laughs> People still keep their heads down around Azadi military. They must fear the worst. The law office. This looks fancy as sh shit in the middle of this place. Why does this building look like it's from, like, Britain? Like, modern Britain. <laughs> and the rest... What the heck? That's weird. I don't... This is a relatively big city. If I had access to the doors, this would be a very, very hard place to navigate. <laughs> okay, we're back in the bones. God, you're so tired of stuff. If you're a ghost, just leave me be. <laughs> just leave me be. Every time. Why would he say that? That's such a weird thing to say. <laughs> because there's this, he, there's a shadow that walks past him, but he can't see it. He just sees a shadow, and he's like, uh -huh. ah. <laughs> he's like, ah, there's a shadow. <laughs> it's a You're ghost. You're just walking out the light. <laughs> Put no, but, your head down. No, 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 because I have that magic potion. Remember, the potion makes oh, me invisible yeah. to them. It's weird because it makes me visible to them. But not the the random villagers. The what, wait, there she is. You've upset the balance of things. You ought to be more careful speaking ill of the Azadi. The walls have ears. Oh, what are they gonna do? Ship me off to one of their re-education camps? I'd like to see them try. They might throw you in Friar's Keep. They wouldn't dare. They respect women that lot. At least they've got that going for them. Unlike those National Front traitors in there. Mark my word. The moment the Azadi Look at his face. He's so fucking scary. Why? Why? Why are you standing so close to her? <laughs> he's listening to all this, standing behind her. Look at his face. He's like, "What do we do?" <laughs> okay, so you have a piece of paper on you. Excuse you? me. Balance. Where did you come from, eh? I didn't even see you. You look at her. Look at you. I don't want no trouble. That piece of paper you tore. Do you have the other half? What piece? The National Front Flyer? Why? Who are you? Someone who's on your side. Well, I dunno. You sound as Ardy to me. What do you want that flyer for? Long story. I need it to find a traitor. A traitor to the rebel cause. Oh, right. Well, if it means getting back at that National Front filth, then by all means. <laughs> Take it. And balance bless you for standing up to those bastards. Yay! Knew it, I just had to find her. Oh, there's my ripped up invitation! I that I totally ripped up myself. It wasn't that girl's one I just picked up in front of you. Or I guess that was a shadow, so you didn't see me pick it up, I guess. <laughs> he wants the correct passphrase before he'll allow me through. It that it's a flyer for the National Front me honor and humanity. It's the slogan used by the National Front. That must be the passphrase I need to get into the meeting. Step aside, brother. God! You snuck up on me. Blood and land. Blood, land, honor and humanity. 
That's what these people claim to care about. I should try echoing. <laughs> slogans like "Burning men cling to driftwood." Honor and humanity. Faith and family, brother. Go on through, mate. The meeting's already begun. If you haven't seen Mr. Illyris speak before, you're in for a proper treat. That man is an example to us all. The master works all. Sisters. Cousins. Brave, humble, human folk. Welcome to this meeting of the National Front for Faith and Family. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> yes, yes. Thank you for coming here tonight. Thank you. Thank you for the generosity of your time. Yeah, he's got no shading. Thank you for braving these ill-lit occult courts in your tireless search for truth. Yes. Oh, yes. Despite the selfless work of our benefactors. You're like a toy. <laughs> lurks out there in the shadows. For they are close. They I'm too are far away to get a real everywhere. sense of that person. I'm too far I away to get them. a real sense of that Do person. Honor Hilaris. He spice. leads this national Nothing. front for faith and family. Filth. It warms my heart to see you standing before me. Standing up for what's good and fair. Glory, cousins. Glory be upon you. In the light of the goddess. Yes. Yes. I spoke recently with our benefactors. I spoke to them about that immigrant, the magical. Yes. 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 I spoke to them. I said, listen to these humble, brave folk, your cousins. Humans brought to their knees by the magical. Driven to bankruptcy to moral corruption. Simple, uncomplicated men and women led astray by the devilish, demonic, magical. The necromancer. I said to them, I said, we need to make a stand. Now. Now. We need to rally behind our benefactors, behind our own. And I said to them, I said, what you need, what they need, what we need, is someone to stand up and speak the human cause. The true Marcurian. Someone not afraid of the magical and his foreign tongues. Yes, yes, you know me, you know me, you know, I seek no fame. Oh my god. Fortune. I seek only truth. I seek the light. I seek just How long are you gonna talk for? Humble <laughs> human folk <laughs> like you. Yes. Yes, yes. I stand here before you well, can't you as your servant. Stand no, that's just observing what he's saying. Servant. Soon the city will elect a new council, a new leader. One who will take responsibility for the lawlessness that haunts these mm. occult Everyone talks so much. To do great work. <laughs> I think I'm supposed to just work. important work. I'm too Most far away to get work. a real sense of that but person. They can't be everywhere. They can't protect all of you from your dark neighbors, and where the Azadi fall On short, Hilaris. where their light he doesn't leads reach. This national front the city faith watch and family. can help. Take the paper dragons that fly above us as we speak. Yes. Those blasphemous constructs that fly in the face of all decent, humble, hard-working human folk. Symbols of the magical. Symbols of the, the, the dry king. <coughs> Fooey. Blasphemous <coughs> betrayal of all of humanity. Oh, Fooey. <coughs> A bunch of donkeys. Cut every donkeys. Line, arrest every traitorous child. Donkeys. They don't, they don't just they make do. that noise over no <laughs> They don't. But what 
Does they, the city watch? They do make it. They stop from being good, it. honest, simple human folk from Am I supposed to have well deserved justice? They stop us from punishing the magical, that immigrant, for his neck. Am I supposed to swatch this till he finishes? Fuck. What? Uh, he honest. just repeated. A young cousin of ours. Did he put in chains? Yeah. For laying righteous hands on a magical. The a magical, magical is just a spell now. Young that. cousin's sister. She'd fallen in with the magical. I'll be right back. Possessed with Wait, dark is she the normal one? Too far away to get a real sanity. There's nothing unusual about that person. And our cousin was thrown in the dungeon for doing what's right. I think it's I'm that too person. far away to get a real sense of that. What's moral? Yes. I'm too far away this to get a real sense of that. Does. You must be wearing these leather undergarments. Simple. Human they make an unpleasant for doing creaking what's noise. Right. What? Trying to save a young girl you must soul. be wearing what? leather Demon. undergarments. The magic leather undergarments. An unpleasant creaking noise. No, no, no. We're right back. I'm too the far away to get a real sense of that person. I'm too far away to get a real sense of that person. Someone who can stand up Nothing in particular the magical stands out. and say, This far and no further. Someone who's willing to make sacrifices, to hammer in a few nails to build a home. The watch is willing to hammer I'm too no far away to get a real sense of that person. To build no home. I blame their leader. That woman with unnatural I'm desires. I'm too far away to get a real sense of that person. And I blame her leaders. Tobacco. That boneless Another council. Variant, unless my slave to the immigrant. Me. The magical. There's nothing unusual what can about that be person. Done? There is There's only nothing. one solution. Change. I'm too far. Change. I'm too far. Yes. Yes. Vote. There's nothing faith unusual about that family. person. Vote blood, I'm land, honor. Her clothes smell strongly of tar and smoke. Vote. She must be National a factory worker. Front and vote he for smoke. your humble human servant. Yours I'm truly, too far away to get a real sense Hillaris. of that person. With my guidance and nothing leadership, in particular stands the out. magical, that subhuman immigrant, the dark necromancer, She's humming to herself. warlock. It's a tune we'll be I recognize. From our home. A sweet lullaby. Our children will be safe to play once more. Our women I'm too far virgin. away to get a... We'll be protected. There's nothing unusual and about that person. Ill-lit, occult I'm too far away to... We'll be lit by the light of the goddess. goddess. That crown of post Sweet odor. smelling, holy He can't have changed his clothes or taken a bath Thank in Thank you. <laughs> I'm too far away Thank to get a real set. Thank you all for coming. must be wearing leather undergarments. There's nothing unusual about that person. Okay. Hmm, okay. What? Um... Smiles upon all good humans. Our, our Honor enemy Hillary. Is the filthy he leads Necromancer. this national front he for faith and family. That's what this is all about. It's about fighting the magical infestation. It's not about which gods we do or do not worship. No, 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 no. The Azadi are nothing if not open minded. They'll never curtail your right to worship your what happened? world. I examined everybody, and then it went. It just went black, and then it went to this. Oh, well, that's to weird. Light is to embrace humanity itself. Thank you Honor again. Hillary. Thank you. He leads this national line, front for faith and family. And remember, vote Hillary. Vote faith and family. Vote national. Oh, he's in the market now. Shadow's name. You can rather know. I guess he's in the marketplace now. Okay. I don't see what. But like, I don't have a beat on this guy, this person, so like I don't know what I'd be looking for in the marketplace. Um, if I take a shot, the shadows are alive. I don't like this posting. Where have you been? Oh. 
Where have you Where been? been? At a National Front meeting, identifying your turncoat. Uh, it takes a traitor to find a traitor. Think you can point him out for us? I can. Go on then, before we lose him. Guy walks like he's gonna punch somebody in a second. Oh my god, I had to. That's the guy? His breathing is heavy and wet. Oh, hello. I can see him. He's salty and distinct. He smells of tobacco. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a Northlands weed. Okay. Oh, Wait, so I'm looking for a traitor in my side, right? The Magicals keep their heads high, despite the Azadi threat. It's a testament to their resilience. That man... Was he at the National Front Assembly? His breathing is heavy and wet. Ready to perform sandwiching to your I've exact to orders. He smells faintly of camphor, or the pine forests of the north. Maybe lavender oil. I'm not quite sure what my cue is to figure out who he is. Yeah. His skin appears red and blistered. Perhaps he spent too much time in the sun. He smells of tobacco. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a Northlands weed. My table's always open, day and night. Okay, let me... Huh. He looks somewhat familiar. I'm putting him down as a suspect. I'm certain I've seen that man somewhere before. You? His breathing is heavy and wet. His breathing is heavy and wet. That beard. Where have I encountered that beard? I think it's this guy. That man. Was he at the National Front Assembly? Because he keeps talking to him in a weird way. He looks somewhat familiar. I'm putting him down as a suspect. He smells of tobacco. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a Northlands weed. Like, you're far away. You look at other people? Kind of. I'm certain I've seen that man somewhere before. Damn it, he says it for everybody. That beard. Where have I encountered that beard? Am I supposed to know something from like a previous thing? Because I don't know what I'm looking for here. That man. Was he at the National Front? He looks somewhat familiar. I'm certain I've seen that man somewhere before. That beard <laughs> this Where guy doesn't know what he's looking for beard. that beard that man i i recognize that man hard to shake the feeling that it's wrong for magicals to be walking around freely and i'll have to get used to that man was he at the national front assembly no potions off do come again his breathing is open, heavy and wet i don't quite remember what, what does that I don't quite remember what what the because there's so many people that I clicked on mm -hmm. I don't remember what all of them said oh uh, okay let's see one guy had leather leather underwear okay uh one person smelled tobacco am I from the am I from the north I don't even know Go on, but that other guy smells of like tobacco, can. but he said he didn't recognize the scent. Wait, so he he's someone that's near me. Wait, hold on. He's a traitor for our... He's on our side. 
But he's a traitor. So... Who am I looking for? I someone familiar. I'm putting him down as a suspect. His breathing is heavy and wet. I'm certain I've seen that man somewhere before. That beard. Where have I encountered that beard? He smells of tobacco. I'm not familiar with the scent. It's probably a Northland's weed. Okay, so not you then, I guess. That man was he at the National Front Assembly. He smells faintly of camphor or the pine forests of the north. Maybe lavender oil. There was a guy with a hat like that, though. Of course, it's possible to clear, sir. Fuck it, let's just accuse this guy. <laughs> Who are you people? Where are you taking me? Have you got the wrong man? Oh shit. <laughs> I, I did an achievement. Oh. I okay. Where's the rooster and the kitten? I don't know if that was the right guy or not. I can't even tell. It probably wasn't. I've heard that the that this game said that if you if you the decision you make will affect the game. But what what I actually heard was. The, the better what you do, the game will play out the same way, no matter what you do. And like the, the the like the game will play out any way, which way. Oh. Regardless of what you did. <laughs> so I don't know if it actually matters or not. Southernmost parts of Mercuria. Number four. Uh, old town in the the circle. I don't know what I was supposed to be looking for for that that guy. I don't either. That was so confusing. It was like you gotta look for some guy who reminds you of some guy you saw the thing, but there wasn't any thing that resembled what Found I was nice shift, thinking of. I think I led down to that cheap tavern by the arbor. What was it called again? The cock and puss. No, no, no. Ah, the rooster and kitten. That's it. Wait, did he just say his by by the river? While my veil is active, they cannot recognize me. Not unless I want them to, or I act carelessly. I thought I was by number four. A map of the southernmost parts of Mercuria. <laughs> See is Arity Avenue. Yeah, it's over there. It's over by the avenue. I think he's going up. Cause I have to go to the uh, the already uh, the uh, avenue. <laughs> Did you hear the one about the magic? Who's there? I have to go to the other uh, uh, avenue. <laughs> already, already the already the avenue there. Already? Is that it? No, that's Red Fred. Where's the fucking map? <laughs> Where am I? There it is. Rooster and Kitten. So it actually is called Rooster and Kitten. Inu's just got a sick little mind. <laughs> oh god, I'm so confused. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> I've lost the plot. I don't know what's going on anymore with this guy's storyline. <laughs> Look at this guy. He's an ogre. <laughs> what can I get you, my good man? Wine! Goddess knows I'm not a drinking man. What does one order to blend properly in with the patrons of this filthy hive? A glass of iced wine, please. <laughs> iced wine. Wine and ice. Are, are you trying to draw attention to yourself? Here's your merry minstrum, da. 
Look at his little picture on his fucking apron. Your friend. Kitty your friend. and a kitten and friend. a rooster. Yes, your friend. She's been waiting. You don't want to keep a woman waiting for too long. I got my ice wine. <laughs> I don't think it's ice wine. I think he gave you a different. No, it's ice wine. See, there's ice. What is ice wine? <laughs> I should be getting home. Just one more. One more for the road. A bit of Dolmari courage to help me get started. And then I'll head home. What the? Ah, oh, finally. There you are. Sit. Who the fuck are you? Please. I saved your seat. Sit down. Why are you looking like you're from The Witcher? <laughs> you look quite ridiculous standing there. Where? The seat? Oh, the stool. Smile. We're old friends, remember? I don't remember that at all. Who are you? I'll tell you who I'm not. I'm not with the Resistance, and I'm not Azadi. If you're not with the Resistance and you're not Azadi, oh, is, that, is this the who are you the, the girl with the with the normal I'm name? Me, and I can either make your life easier or a lot worse. Curious. Who in Shadow's name is this woman? It's it's um. If she's looking for me, I need to know why. It's the previous, the first. I think it's the first, uh, the first lady in the first game. The girl, the girl that I'm f I was fighting for that I changed resistance. This must be a mistake. The publican was clearly confused. This woman is not looking for me. She claims to be my friend and then she threatens me. Not the best way to begin a conversation. Who in sh... I will have your name. You will have my name. So forceful. So like a caged animal. She's the first You're girl. A popular man, Kino Vane. Her hair's flipping out. Yep. Yeah. Everyone wants a piece of you. I hear there's even a bounty on your head. I'm afraid you've left me at a disadvantage. I'll even the battlefield. I have as many names as I have friends and enemies. She's the girl you worked for, so dude. Call me Anna. What do you want from me? Oh, Anna. I like the emphasis. You're a clever boy. When she talks, her hair flips out. I want your assistance, <laughs> but not right now. She must have a someone. very billowing I'm voice. I just you? wanted a chance to introduce myself, and now I have, so it's time to leave. Let me up sometime. You can find me at this table most evenings. If not, Olvik can pass a message. Big man behind the bar. Wears an apron with a cock, a rooster, and a kitten on it. Can't miss him. Be seeing you, friend. Wait. How did you see through my veil? What? You shouldn't be able to recognize me on sight. Unless you know me intimately. I don't know what you're talking about. Be seeing you, Alvane. It's it's obviously the girl in the first game. The one who became the resistance leader. Look 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 how she's dressed. That's a future lady. Yeah. You're dumb, Kian. <laughs> you're so dumb. You and your eyes wide. <laughs> <laughs> this idiot. That's who. Like, this. there's such thing called chilled wine. Look at this fucking guy. 